play Forever Over by Eden. We're in standard tuning. There's no capo. This is going to be just a basic version of the song. So I'm going to go over the chords here real quick. We're going to go through them real quickly because the emphasis of this video is not going to be the chords, but how to play the chords. We have an E chord, an A chord. We have a B minor chord, an F sharp minor chord, and a D chord. Those are the main chords we're going to be playing. If you already know how to play those chords, you can go ahead and skip ahead. For now, I'm going to give a brief little um, introduction. So for a D chord, you have your index on the 2nd fret of the G, middle fingers on the 2nd fret of the high E, ring fingers on the 3rd fret of the B, play those 4 strings. For an A chord, these fingers are all sandwiched in on the 2nd fret, pinkies on the 2nd fret of the B, ring fingers on the 2nd fret of the G, middle fingers on the 2nd fret of the D, play 5 strings down. For an E chord, your index starts on the 1st fret of the G string, middle fingers on the 2nd fret of the A, and your ring fingers on the 2nd fret of the D. Here's your E chord. B minor chord is a bar chord. You bar the second fret, and then you have your A minor position up here. Your A minor shape with these three fingers. And then your F sharp minor is your E minor shape, but you're barring the whole second fret, playing all six strings. So I went through those chords pretty quickly. I know. Uh, and there's other videos where I teach you how to play those chords, and you can figure out how to play those chords on your own. But we're going to go ahead and start with the progression here. So we start on an A chord. Pick our A string and our B string. Do that twice and let it ring. Then we're going to switch to our E chord. Now we're playing our top E note and our G string. Do that twice. Then you go to your F sharp minor. Play the same note, so the E and the G. Do it twice. And then we go to our D chord. And now I'm playing the D and the high E string. Do that twice. And then it starts over. So it goes A, I'm gonna speed this up here, um, but in the song it's actually really slow. So it goes A, A, then we go to our E. F sharp minor, and finally to your D. So the song does that a couple times, and then it transitions into kind of the chorus with this progression. So we're going to go to a B minor, and there's actually this C sharp minor chord in here, which is the same thing as the B minor, but you shift it up to the fourth fret. And there's an A, and it goes back to the A. So that goes like this. It goes B minor, D chord, C sharp minor, and then your A chord. And that's before it transitions into the, um, to the chorus. So what I'm doing there is I'm picking the A and the B string. Then the D and the high E, C sharp minor, A and the high E, and then on your A chord just the A and the B strings again. Okay, so that's kind of like the pre-chorus that transitions into the chorus, and then the chorus itself sounds like this. So that progression goes like this. It goes A, B minor, F sharp minor. You stay on the F sharp for four. Then we go to our E, A, D. One more time on that. A, B minor, F sharp minor. Stay on there for four. E, A, and D. And that's all there is to it. So that's the three um, chunks. I've split it up into a chorus, a pre-chorus, and a verse. Um, Eden does his songs a little different. They're um, not really as like traditional, so it's kind of hard to 
figure things out. But that should give you the guidelines you need to play along with the song. So that's going to be it for this tutorial. If you have questions, go ahead and comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.